Hello and welcome to another review. This time it's a iPhone app and it's the BBC News app we are showing you. Obviously this ain't just this hasn't long been launched and I'm going to correctly give you an overview on it. So the top here you got uh, edit of course BBC News live and like a, a flash update button to bit there. Then you've got top stories, you got world news, you got UK, then I scroll up, like so, shows me sports, technology, if I go even more down, I can search for more, so I can look at uh, England by clicking on there, and you show me more. Click again and you close, and there's also different categories. At the bottom, you got send image, send story, so you can send them a story. Help terms of use and privacy policy. Um, the just showing on the top news actually. On the top news, you can also scroll across, like so, to see what others are there. You can do this on all the categories. Um, let's just take this one for example. In technology, BBC News iPhone app is launched. So you just click on that, and you can obviously go down and read all about it. If the text is too small for you. Right at the bottom, you can click to increase. Or decrease. Also, if you click here, see that? Push on that. You can send that by uh, email, share on Facebook, or share on Twitter. I'll go back at there. And we take something on the top. So let's have a look at. Uh, I don't know. I ain't got one. You have mail. There you go. Now some of them are uh, some of your news uh, things you go into. So you, you think, oh yeah, this could be interesting to read. Open up. You could actually have a tap to play. So it's got like a video inside. So you tap that once. You would open it up, start to load, and it will play. I've had to pause because I ain't got broadcast rights there, obviously. Unfortunately. Uh, if I turn sound down, so you can play that. I can enlarge, I can turn the phone, apparently. Uh, not on this one. Yeah, I thought you could, this is my mistake. Now I can click on done. So you can play like the clips from inside the posts. If I go back and click on edit, here I can drag around where I want stuff. So to me, I'm more I'm more interested in like this or that. Technology, UK news and sports. That's how I like it. But then I could add more if I wanted. So if I click on like uh, the entertainment of art, it would bring you up to the top here. See, put it in there so I can add more to the top stories if I want to. Uh, I want to go remove that. Like so, then click done, and there you have it. It's been reorganised. Obviously, your top story is just at the top, but then it goes into the order I've just put it in. If you scroll down like that, it will refresh, and also the live button, which I'll show you now. I'll click on live. Uh, this is a 360 one. Uh, I'm going to enlarge that full screen. Can I turn it? No. Trust me, it does turn because I've, I've had it done. It's just I'm um, holding at the uh, video camera angle. No, it's not. I've now I've done. I've locked portrait. Duh. There you go. 
as you see now it's on the side and I could start to play it but obviously I've got broadcast rods so I can't but yeah it is the live is the live BBC news so you can watch live the, the live news channel basically oh, let's tip it back okay, done now the like, storyboard here right, you can also have it on the side which just does show it a bit differently right. here you got the uh, top stories so you click on that and you can go through and read the top stories and underneath it just gives you like a bit of a like a summary sort of thing just tells you a little bit about that particular news board or news post mm. then, oh, excuse me. then at the top I can click on technology scroll across UK scroll across world news and so on and so on so you can either have it on the side or facing up like that it's up to you uh, overall um, I'm liking it it does the job well uh, I do read news quite often especially technology news and overall BBC uh, has done a good job with their news application I'm going to give this a GT ratings of uh, 5 out of 5 I can't see anything I would improve myself it's got everything in even the ability to send a, a story so you know send story I can send them an email or text them yeah so it has got everything you need to read and even send news well that's it for me that was the uh, review on the iPhone app the BBC news and as always you can find me on www.geekstech.co.uk twitter.com forward slash four geeks tech that's the number four uh, me dot me geeks tech sorry me dot me forward slash geeks tech my mistake uh, you can search for us on Facebook, Geeks Tech, or YouTube.com, uh, Geeks Tech, which is where all our videos are available. Uh, we've got LiveQA.co.uk, sorry, we've got TechQA.co.uk, which is a community based for technical questions and answer site. But if you've got any questions or queries, maybe you want to send me something to review, sure, send me an email at Wayne at Geeks, ge at geeks Okay. <laughs> Don't you care? Well, until the next time, I will see you later.